Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Simply K back with another video, video, video. Welcome back. This is the cash stuffing for the second paycheck of March. Um, things will be a little bit different. We're not stuffing too much, but we are doing um, a special payment towards debt for my car loan. So without further ado, we're gonna hop right into this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let's get right into it. Today's a little bit different. Today it's actually Friday. This video is gonna go up on Monday as usual, but today was payday. So I'm just gonna let you guys know what's going on. It's officially been one month since I've been married. That went by fast. So I decided to focus on mostly just debt, this payment. Um, I did have to make a payment towards my regular Wells Fargo credit card, which I did use for a little bit more than I was supposed to, but it's okay, things happen. Um, so I made a payment to that to bring it back down to the balance it was at before I used it. But I was gonna stuff some money, but then I decided not to because I just sat and thought about priorities and what I wanted to do and when I wanna pay this car loan off. So instead of doing a cash stuffing, I'm gonna go through my envelopes, make sure everything is up to date, and then if I have any rollover money, I will stuff that probably to March Madness, but it also saves me a trip from running to the bank. I don't have to do that today, but I don't really need to stuff the envelopes, so I'm not too um, upset about it because most of the money is going to be going to debt. So I'm going to get my cash envelopes. Um, gas still has $20 in there, which is good. I have not had to use that yet. Toll has 15 Emergency fund I have not touched, that's at 125. I was messing with some of these envelopes. Car maintenance, I also did not mess with. It has $100 in there. Date night has $3 left over, so we're gonna take that out. Um, we've been bad, we've been eating out a lot. So I'm gonna put that as rollover. So we're starting out with zero. We honestly don't need to eat out next week, so it's okay to have nothing in there. Um, I also do have seven dollars over here crusty dollars for sure these this was um toll change so i'm also going to put that over there medical dental still has 30 groceries has 10. i don't know where i put the five i think i took the five out of here so i just need to update that i don't know when i did that but now there's $10 in there, that's fine. I'm actually gonna go to the store today and get some stuff so I can make my lunch for work for this weekend. Shopping has zero. Bank deposits has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. That has 100 in there to go towards the care credit. Um, our puppy did have his first doctor's appointment and we had to buy some food and he also got his first shot. So I used the care credit for the visit and that was like $100, so that will be going into the bank so that we can pay the care credit balance. I love that thing. It really um, came in handy with our other dog. So that's that. For sinking funds, we're gonna check this out. I will be going in and using some of these this week because I have two birthdays next week, so. Beauty has 10. Vacation has 25, not touching that. Gifts has 80, which I will be using. My twins, nephews, um, they turn two next week, and then my brother's birthday is the 30th, so I need to go out and get some stuff. Christmas has $100 in there. Home Reno has 25, but we did have some extra money, 20, 40, 60, 80, that I put in there from wedding money, wedding cash, so we have 80 dollars added into there so i can add 80. so i don't want to do that in my head 125 plus 80 205 so there's 205 in there and everything will get updated later i'm kind of moving my office to a different room in our house so everything's kind of everywhere so i will update all that later hubby has five dollars 
Puppy has 10. We'll be needing to go get him some food soon. Car loan is what we are going to talk about. So, car loan. Last time you guys saw, if you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't, follow me on Instagram. The balance for this car loan right now is $4,501.93. You guys. I just paid a thousand dollars for my stimulus check to that and that is the the final balance so i need to up, update my um debt tracker but today i paid dun, 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 620 dollars towards my car loan so i was going to use some of this money to do a cash stuffing but i'm like i really don't need to stuff and i'm really trying to just pay this loan off and get it down and I was going to put like $500 to it, but then I was like, then I'd have $1.93 because after interest, it wouldn't be under $4,000. And I'm like, I really want to see that three. So if you take $4,501.93 and interest, I don't know. They didn't take out any interest on the $1,000 I put in, but I'm just going to say minus like $600. Just say they take out $20 in interest. I don't know. The balance will be $3,901.93. You guys. 3,000. 3,000. Okay? 3,000. If you remember, in January, we started at 7,000. Let me, like, be sure. We started at $7,853.45 in the beginning. So, I just want to see how much we paid so far. 7,853.45. Say the 30... 90193 is the balance, but we'll get all definites probably Monday when the payment clears. Minus 3901. That means we paid so far $3,951.52 paid. Almost $4,000 paid January, February, March. That's crazy. That's three months. Three months, almost $4,000 paid. I don't know about y'all, but that is a big win for me. So, $3,951. And I will have $3,900 left. And I just see the finish line. And it's just so exciting. So, that's basically what we did today was put the $620 towards the car loan. And I'm okay with it. I don't need anything. I have enough gas money in here. I have toll money. And that's the only thing that I would really need. And then I have grocery money. And then in our savings, we still have $10. So then I'm going to pull out my envelopes. And I am excited to share with you guys some new additions. So March Madness, we're just going to stuff the, like all this stuff. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Okay, that's cool. I don't know what I'm going to use this for, you guys. I really don't. Should use it to pay something. But I don't know what. So we're just going to stuff that in there. I don't know how much is in there. I mean, I know. But if you guys want to know, stay tuned. Find out the next Monday what is in this envelope and what we're going to use it for. Very excited, but look at that. Mm -hmm. Now, these are some new additions. You guys, do you like these? Do you like these or do you not like these? These are my new envelopes that I made for myself. I'm very excited. This is going to be for um, just my business as a whole. YouTube, so I'll put my YouTube money in here. Or if I need updating stuff like new camera, um, ring lights, stuff like that. Nurse stuff, I have to get recertified, renew my license, and all that coming up. So I wanted to make an envelope for that. And then also I can get put money for scrubs and stuff in there. And new shoes. Then grad school, I will talk about my whole plan for grad school in another video. But I wanted to make an envelope for that. My Etsy shop, stuff should be going up probably in April. I'm just working on a lot right now. And then taxes for Etsy shop and YouTube as we start getting paid for those. So I'm very excited. They're very easy to make. So if you're interested, is this something that you would want to see in the Etsy shop? I could do different um, cardstock paper. So it doesn't have to be white. But y'all know my theme is like marble and gold. So I thought that would be cute. But I like them. I'm excited. So I'm going to throw all that in there. That is kind of all I have for today. We just were making the debt payment. And then stuffed the rest of the rollover money in March Madness. But 
every small thing counts and this is amazing for me so i'm very excited i cannot wait to see this number go down more and more but i hope you guys enjoyed this short little video don't forget to like comment and subscribe follow me on instagram so you can stay up to date with all the things that i am doing and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys